What's going on everybody? Level and Diecast here. Super early in the morning. It's 5.30 in the morning. And uh, we're up early because, you know, they say early bird gets the worm. And uh, certainly we hope that happens today because uh, we're going to go pig hunting. All right, guys, we are at our first store. We are at Wally Mart and uh looks like a typical walmart looks like a tornado hit complete disaster uh, looks like they got some m2s somewhat recently that's pretty cool I'm not gonna pick that up but that is still pretty cool let's see look at this disaster a couple new two pack or i'm sorry uh auto lift packs the econo line the skyline is in there Camaro so nothing fancy nothing new some other stuff here um, it's kind of cool not I don't collect that kind of stuff but that's okay always try to look down here in this jumble of stuff sometimes you do find some things here and there a 100 looks like oh, look at that isn't that supposed to be a chase Kevin Harvick there you go. It's supposed to be the liquid metal one, I think. I don't think it's a regular one, but there we go. Whole whole peg of those. Um, nothing else here. Nothing new. Just a disaster. Everything's a disaster at Walmart. Disaster, disaster. Uh, no character stuff. No new monster trucks. Um, unfortunately. Nothing new there. There's a, actually, there's a new color changer. The duck and roll. It's pretty cool. Uh, what else we got going on here? Uh, this one's from a newer mix, I think. Yeah, 2024. Let's see what's on the back. Oh, yeah, that's the mix that's been out. Um, man, dismal. Absolutely dismal. Look at the matchbox. The matchbox here. Absolutely terrible. Hot Wheels. Completely empty. Got yeah, lots of mystery cars. Oof. Tough. Tough. All right, everybody. We are at uh, Walmart. Uh, this Walmart's been a little bit better than other Walmarts. You check that out. They actually have some new collectors. Got the Celica, got the BRZ, looks like that might be all they have, they got another BRZ, those are the two models I feel like would be gone, not the other models in the mix, I can't, can't remember which ones are in the mix, but uh, it's interesting, well, at least we found something, so we're going to take those guys, let's see what else here is, Audi moving parts, we got the uh, BMW. I didn't know that either. I These Mercedes have been here forever. Look at that. I think it's crushed. Crushed. Uh, basics, nothing. Put the BMW back up there. Let's see what we got hiding down here. Ooh, look at that. Somebody actually managed to steal a moving parts. There you go box is sealed but they stole the car out of it mm. it took some effort it definitely took some effort I can tell you that so let's see here throw some of this stuff back up there we'll take these two guys unfortunately that's that's all they have nothing on the top either as far as Hot Wheels goes um, no series cars or anything like that. Tons of the Spider-Man junk. Just junk, junk, junk. Somebody was working their way to steal a Lego, which is not uncommon for this store. Um, no new case, no D case, I guess you could say, but there is some, there's 2024 case. Oh, there is a D case car there. So we've gone all over that stuff. Nothing, nothing else in there. Lots of uh, fresh metal models here, but this is an old mix. Uh, nothing new quite yet. 
Uh, getting down here, monster trucks. Doesn't look like there's any new monster trucks. Another new, look at that. There's another Celica. I wonder, I wonder if these were uh, somebody's stash or something like that. So, I don't know. We'll take that one too though. Uh, let me see here, let me stack this real quick. There we go. Uh, kind of weird, just kind of weird. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Some new M2s. I have not seen before. Volkswagen's pretty cool. Definitely not something that we do, but that is still pretty cool. Let's see if we can find the Hague real quick. Where these are supposed to go. Um, no, we're just gonna set it over there for now. Uh, some other mixed stuff here on the bottom. Nothing fancy. That is a pretty cool casting though from M2. Um, another one of those blazers that one's a little bit better just because the top is still on but so let's set that aside as well uh same model kits nothing new there nothing down here same old same old rolling through so interesting but this is a this is a pretty good pickup pretty happy about that you get a couple of those so we'll grab those ones and uh We'll roll. All right, guys, we're at Target. We're going to start up at the check lanes. Sometimes, sometimes they stock up here. They do have some uh, DK stuff. So we're gonna check real quick, just because they look pretty full. Of course, I've never had luck finding anything at the check lanes. So just peeking through here. I was hoping maybe there'd be some reds. Oh, well, that's a pretty good pickup. Been struggling to find one of those. I wanted some extras, so we'll take that guy. That's a good sign. Maybe that means that, you know, maybe these are not picked through. So we'll take that guy. See what else we got going on here. They definitely, definitely put out some stuff on the check lines here. If I can quit dropping cars. Let's see. Nothing else there. I'll keep moving down. Roll over here. A couple more. Pigs, try to move quick so we can get back to the actual pigs. Let's see, we got a couple other things here. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Nothing else. Pretty nice to find this though. Pretty happy about that. Let's see. <clears throat> a couple of stragglers there. Couple more models here. Just looking through. Got that RX-7. I think I've dropped the car every single peg I've touched. Throw that up there. Looks like. Unfortunately, that's it. So, no regular, no soups. Nothing back here. Nothing in that one there. Not stocked. Neither is that one. So let's head back to the actual pigs. All right, back to the actual pigs here, which actually don't look half bad uh, to start with. Uh, let's see what we got going on here. We got some Jada, got some hyper spec, some new colors, some Lambos, C8s. Ooh, that's pretty cool. New pink slips. Ooh, look at that, look at that error. Porsche Carrera with the, but this thing is, oh, it's been opened. So they reboxed it. There is the Carrera there. That is a really, really nice casting, by the way. Looks pretty good. And then we have the Corvette. And 
the McLaren, which is pretty cool, 720S. I don't uh, collect any of this stuff anymore, so just leave that there. We do have Majorette pack. It's still the same Porsche pack we've been seeing for a zillion years. Nothing new on the pink slip sides or anything like that. Some Johnny Lightnings. The SSR. It's kind of cool. Kind of cool to bring that casting back. The Citation. It's pretty cool. A couple new, a couple toe packs. Nothing new. Nothing new else from Johnny. Just Mach E's. No new Majorettes. No new micro machines. Lots of bikes and uh, skateboards and stuff. Those are always stocked up. Monster trucks for the most part are always stocked up. I do carry collectors here. <sighs> Unfortunately, not the new mix. There's a charger. We're gonna add that to my hoard. But uh, unfortunately, nothing else as far as basics goes. And then lots of blue Hummers, lots and lots of blue Hummers. I got a few of those Porsches, so I'll leave that for the next guy. Yeah. I bought like seven of those packs to finally get the, the variation on that Volkswagen Golf. The interior variation is a pain in my butt. Uh, new nine packs. So I actually already got these. I post these up on my Insta. Um, I already cracked them. I don't, I don't remember. I don't think I cracked them on the case, but at National Parks, uh, International Ambulance, and then of course the uh, MG looks pretty good. So those are the two new nine packs. So nice that Target still carries those. Um, 143rd scales, they don't have the Skyline and that stuff yet. Not here anyways. Premiums, this is exactly how premiums looks at every store. Nobody ever has premiums. Uh, they have one transport it's from the new Ur mix. So still waiting on that. Here's those new pullbacks. So just some regular ones here, nothing fancy. Everybody's going crazy over that Porsche because it's got a treasure hunt symbol. Um, basics here. Looks like pretty decent amount of basics. Um, they definitely look like they've been gone through a little bit. These are, it uh, looks like D case. Look at that. Just a regular Dotson wagon. We're gonna, we're gonna leave that because I don't particularly care. Uh, let's see what else we got going on here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. No reds. Still looking for some reds. Uh, just random D case stuff. So nothing, nothing really noteworthy on the uh, five pack front. But those are the five packs there. These new uh, twenty packs are actually pretty nice. There's a couple different versions floating around, but it does have the Porsche in there, which is pretty, pretty nice. So there is a there's a yellow GT2 Porsche in like the second run of these um, that everybody says is exclusive to that. So if you're a Porsche guy, I'd wait to get that pack if that's the one you're gonna get. There are no dump bins, unfortunately, at this store. So let's roll. All right, guys, we were at another Walmart. This Walmart is a little bit smaller Walmart and I don't have a whole lot of faith that uh, I'll find anything here, but uh, just the previous mix of moving parts. Lots and lots of Audis. Those are two per case, so it doesn't surprise me. These M2s are hitting pretty hard. I'll take this guy back. No new monster trucks, unfortunately. Lots of character cars. They're always fully stocked, always. Uh, skateboards always fully stocked as well. Um, Look at that. Oh, sweet. Finally. Finally some, some new M2 stuff. Been looking for that one. 
pretty stoked about that one. That one's all super Mopard out, so we're gonna get that guy. We'll set that to the side. Um, this is another one from that mix. That's a pretty nice one. Not uh, not my cup of tea, but that one is still pretty nice. It's probably still here because the package is messed up. So put this up here. A couple more of those Volkswagens we've already seen. So. Uh, some M2 kits, some older ones, uh, nothing else with these haulers, another Mopar hauler there, another Chevy truck, it's got loose parts in it, you always got to check that, uh, they stuck some super rigs down there for some reason, um, nothing through here, they got some of these new character cars, you got Transformers, you got Lucky Charms, that's pretty cool Volkswagen bus pretty cool you challenger for Thor so these are all mixed up let's set those up there of course no premiums of course um, no uh, none of these starships I'm still looking for the Imperial shuttle which is number eight it's impossible to find no new premiums well that's 2024 premiums but it's nothing new uh, let's see here that's it but uh, take this guy shaking no no parts loose that's a good one and uh, let's roll all right we're at another Walmart which I haven't been to this Walmart in a long time but check this out they have electronic price tags here First time I've seen that, it's kind of interesting. Looks kind of cool though. Looks kind of fancy. Um, unfortunately, everything else is gonna be the same that we've seen from every other store. They do have one single one of those fast wagons, which not even supposed to be over here. I'm sure it's supposed to be somewhere on that side. Um, no new matchbox. Uh, just the Audi moving parts, nothing through here, store is dismal, there we go, look at that, clearance, very interesting, interesting, I wonder if that includes these, look at that, somebody tried to poke a hole in it, ah, well, that's not good. I've not seen those on clearance anywhere, but it doesn't look like it's gonna be anything good. Uh, that's all the Mazda and Fiat and stuff like that. That's probably why. Interesting to see that guy chilling there. We'll put him back over where he's supposed to be. There we go. Um, no new monster trucks. Um, well, they have a new R mix, but uh, nothing that's brand new. Of course, character star cars are always stocked up. Tech deck stuff is always stocked up. Just nobody buys those. Um, and then we get to the collector spot. Looks like they got the same M2s. They've got the haulers. They don't have any new diorama packs. Look at this. Look at that. That's all the premium section. It's literally every store literally every store nobody stocks anything so and then of course the shelves look absolutely like you know a tornado hit them which is pretty common for Walmart so let's roll all right guys we're at another Walmart don't get too excited we're probably gonna see all the same junk these are super tore up. These are all old cards, but look at this. Look at this. Look at the size of this dump in. Look at this. And nobody's ever gonna buy any of these. It's 99% fantasy castings. There is some newer stuff in here. I mean, these cards are destroyed already. That's, that's insane, the size of that thing. Uh, same old, old matchbox, nothing new. 
unfortunately. Still, still 2023 stuff. <sighs> no new moving parts, just the Fiat, unfortunately. Moving through here, older five packs. Nothing else new there. Monster truck, same old, same old. At least this store looks a little bit more stocked up, even though it's old stuff. At least it's a little bit more stocked up, but not premiums. There's never premiums. Literally no store ever has premiums. I, oh, look at that. I bought this at a local uh, hobby store, or hobby swabby because I didn't think I'd ever find it. And look at that, I actually, actually found it. There's actually two of them. Well, that's pretty cool. I don't do Chevy trucks, but that's that's pretty cool. I don't know if I, I don't know if I want to pick that one up or not, but that one is that one's pretty cool. So I don't know. Maybe I'll leave that for the next person. It's just a it's an impulse buy. I do that a lot. Uh, no new kits. No new majorette. No new uh, pink slips. Ah, uh, same old, same old down here. Nothing new. No new Star Wars ships pretty much all the same thing there is uh, a Subi haven't seen that Subi in a little bit uh, Ninja Turtles Camaro there in the back and then tons and tons of the rally sets so unfortunately the uh, hope to, to find that new Porsche diorama is going to be very very tough um, at least here here in the Maha city so let's uh let's roll all right guys yet another walmart and yet another story same old same old at least they have some relatively stocked up moving parts uh you got some rangers teslas got the audi got the mercedes the bmw but uh no no chases no um, Paganis. So there is a Pagani in that uh, B case. Super, but there is none here. But uh, definitely the most moving parts we've seen yet. But uh, as far as basics, we're still on 2023. Still. It's absolutely dismal for Matchbox. Ah, monster trucks. Again. If I have the Hummer, hmm, what's in this? What's in the mix? Oh yeah, with the uh, Skyline. I remember that mix. Old school mix. Nothing new here. This is a relatively small Walmart, so they don't really have much for premiums. That's a pretty common piece. We've seen that several times today already. They do carry the new M2s, but uh, we picked that guy up already. That's the first version of the ramp truck. Um, looks like that's about it. Um, rally diorama box set, so nothing there as well. That's pretty cool, but no more M2 stuff for us. So... That's it. Nothing fancy down here. It's all the cheap stuff. So they do have a dump bin. I guess we'll look at the dump bin real quick. But uh, no faith, no faith. Well, they actually have two dump bins. Looks like these were. At least this side was a decase dump bin, uh, and this side was probably the C case. They kind of got these back to back. So, um, unfortunately, you can tell these have been well gone through. So, let's roll. Another Walmart. Let's see. I don't know, it seems redundant. It seems like, it seems like I'm at the same store every time, but I promise you, they are different. A couple of Jurassic Parks still hanging on the pegs here. Ah, real working rigs, no new singles. Same moving parts, 
still trying to find mix three. The same situation with the monster trucks. At least this store's clean, like nice and clean and organized. Looks looks all right. Just doesn't have anything on the pegs. Lots of those Mopars that we just recently seen. Nothing new there. Same kits we've been seeing all day. But uh, no premiums. No premiums. That is the case all the time. There's just no, no premiums, no nothing. Or something I haven't seen before. But it's a completely destroyed Pontiac GTO. But, and then a Corvette. Bronco I don't do the 124 scale stuff so yeah yeah let's roll all right we are at Target finally get to break up the monotony a little bit but uh, not the visuals I guess so no new moving parts as far as anything past <clears throat> the A and B cases lots and lots of Hummers. Let's see, no Reds, unfortunately. No new singles here at all. Those are still 2023 singles. No new five packs. They do have some new ur nine packs with the National Parks bus. Um, nothing on sale for diecast. It's always everything else. Still have plenty of those Target trucks. Lots of them. No new 143rd scale stuff. Of course, premiums as always. I might actually have a heart attack if I actually found some premiums at a store for a change. Um, and then just regular stuff here. Looks like they did have some new cases, some D case, at least one D case at some point in time, but uh, nothing now. So this is a relatively small target it's not a super target so just more of these pullbacks which look kind of cool still on the fence um, whether I'd want to buy any of them or not so nothing fancy that course that everybody's going off about being a treasure hunt it's actually not that hard to find so um let's see if they have a dump bin I do not have a dump bin, so I guess let's roll. All right, guys, we are at King Supers, which is my local Kroger affiliates. See if uh, maybe they have something here. Always lots of character cars, always lots of character cars. Uh, lots of Masters of the Universe. That's it. Some of them pullbacks, which are pretty expensive here even on sale um, they do have some of those uh, themed packs I do need that Porsche so maybe I'll pick this up it's 12 bucks it's on sale it's not too bad um, as far as basics go I mean I don't know about you guys but at least at least here Kroger's are always way way behind um, some collectors, just some of the A-case, old moving parts, old, old moving parts, nothing good there. Uh, Sky Busters, no SpaceX stuff, unfortunately. Apologize about the overhead, it's very, very loud here. So, I got lots of... Skybusters, just nothing new. Nothing new. Matchbox singles, no new five packs, nothing like that. Um, old muscle machines, like really old muscle machines. Um, do have some Maesta designs. I don't think they'll have something that I don't already have. So, which is unfortunate. So, nothing new there. Kind of cool that Volkswagen, but. Um, no new transporters, some of those uh, work trucks, some more 
toe and go stuff down there, some more pullbacks, just kind of miscellaneous stuff, just kind of mixed around. There's a new, there's a new five pack for 2024. That's pretty cool. That monster truck, that Hummer that we saw earlier. That's actually pretty cool. I don't have the two on the left, but uh, at least they're still making them. Let's see. Oh, they got another one here. This one is kind of fantasy castings and stuff. Not a big fan of that stuff. So, so same old, same old. No new two packs. Ah, the store is just as bad as everything else. Uh, ridiculous amount of Lego minifigures. In case you wanted those. Uh, they do have an in cap, but again, it's all old. This is all old stuff. This is the H case from last year, from 2023. So, really old stuff. So, nothing else here. It's just other other toys and stuff. So, look at this. They have yet another one. Again, all old stuff. This is nothing new, unfortunately. And, hmm. All right, all right, let's go.